Hello everyone, welcome back to the Artistry in Dentist. Today, we are going to talk about a topic that is incredibly important, the prevention of oral cancer. Oral cancer can affect anyone, but there are steps you can take to reduce your risk. So, let's dive right in. Before we get into prevention, it is crucial to understand what oral cancer is. Oral cancer can affect the lips, tongue, gums, cheek line and the flow of the mouth. It's essential to be aware of the symptoms such as persistent mouth sores, white or red patches and difficult to solve. The primary risk factor for oral cancer are tobacco and alcohol. If you smoke or use tobacco products, switching is the best thing you can do for your oral health. Limiting alcohol consumption can also reduce your risk. Eating a balanced diet rich in fruits and vegetables can boost your oral health. These foods are packed with vitamins and antioxidants that help protect your mouth from cancer-causing substances. Don't forget about sun protection. Lips can also develop cancer. So when you are outdoors, wear a wide brim hat and use lip balm with sun protective factor to shield your lips from harmful UV rays. Regular dental checkups are vital. Dentists can spot early signs of oral cancer and other dental issues. Make sure to schedule your routine checkups and follow your dentist's advice. The human papilloma virus is a risk factor for oral cancer. Consider getting vaccinated if you are eligible as it can protect against certain type of HPV. Avoid risky behaviors such as oral piercing and the use of sharp objects in your mouth. This practice can increase the risk of oral cancer and infection. Maintaining good oral hygiene is crucial. Brush your teeth at least twice a day, cross daily and use an antiseptic mouthwash. This helps remove harmful bacteria from your mouth. Stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water helps keep your mouth moist and wash away food particles and bacteria that can contribute to oral health problems. Lastly, perform regular self examination Check your mouth for any unusual change, such as lumps, bumps, or sores. If you are notice anything unusual, consult your dentist. In conclusion, preventing oral cancer involves making healthy lifestyle choices, being proactive about your oral health, and seeking professional advice when needed. Remember, early detection can save lives. If you found this video helpful, please like and share it to spread awareness. Stay healthy and take care of the